What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Roy Jones Jr. Roy Jones Jr. reveals talks with Anthony Joshua over trainer role, but backs Derek James to be the right man for the job. Anthony Joshua did not back or did not get back to ring legend Roy Jones over an offer to train him with the American backing his decision to link up with Derrick James. The former heavyweight champion is making changes to his camp for the second time in a year <clears throat> following another defeat to Alexander Usyk. Jones Jr., who is back training Chris Eubank Jr. for his middleweight showdown against Liam Smith this weekend, invited Joshua to their gym in Brighton, but instead the Brighton... Re the Britain, sorry, <laughs> in Brighton. Instead, the Britain returned to the U.S. where he has been working with James. The Texan counts some of the world's finest boxers, as we know. Mm -hmm. And he said, he said, we had some, uh, a couple conversations about him coming to Brighton to trial with me to see if we had any chemistry, but we did not get to that stage. He did not come to Brighton. He said he went to the United States and met with Derek James just before he had a chance to get together. I feel if you have the chemistry and the right connection, there's no point in going back and forth, trying out different trainers. I text him a message as I heard he'd been in America with James and just said, maybe it's a good stick with James if there's chemistry, as I do not want to make it harder for you to make a decision going back and forth. He did not get back to me, but I wish him all the best. Derek James is a great trainer, and let me counterpunch. Um, I'm glad that Roy made it known. Like, look, I reached out to him. He didn't get back to me. But, you know, if he has good chemistry with him, stay with him. And it shows you the temperament of uh, certain people. Like, had that been uh, Lennox Lewis, Lennox Lewis took that a totally different way when he was uh, declined an offer from AJ or an offer from himself to AJ. And, you know, Roy was more calm, you know, about it. He was just like, hey, you know, well, hey, more power to you. But but you did see Roy said, well, he didn't get back to me, you know, uh, but I do wish him the best. And Derek James is a good person. In other words, this is what Roy was saying. OK, Roy was saying it's shitty that he didn't get back to me, but I'm glad he picked who he picked. And there's no need is going back and forth. But he should have got back to me because anybody that says anything in regards to uh, what happened or, or uh, <clears throat> what a person didn't do. That explains, or it really should amplify passively, really, that maybe he should have done that. And I think the only thing uh, Roy Jones was uh, really had his spliff about, really, if anything, <clears throat> he should have just at least got back to him. And this is one thing. I do agree with Roy. Mm -hmm. I think if you're going to be a person that's supposed to have supposed uh, work or relationship with someone, it's better to get back to them. That's a, that's the professional thing. I think if you do anything else that lets everything is kind of like, hey, it's showing lack of respect, honestly, because he could have told him, like, look, I'm going with him. Because if you can remember, uh, AJ contacted Robert that he was with, like, look, I'm going to look on other things and I'm checking out other people. And Robert was like, cool. You know, as opposed to you and Roy having talks, well, you could have told Roy something similar. You could have had that similar energy with Roy Jones Jr., though. You know, and Roy, again, he didn't mention it like that because he's too much of an alpha. But he did mention, hey, he didn't get back to me, but that's okay. But I wish him the best. You know what I mean? He didn't have to say that unless he meant something by mentioning, mentioning that. Okay, he mentioned that for a reason. So make, make no mistake about it. He mentioned that shit for a reason. Like, hey, he didn't get back to me, but I wish him the best. You know what I mean? But he's letting everyone know, like, what happened. Like, I talked to him. I invited him here. He didn't come. I heard he was somewhere else. I reached out to him, and he didn't respond. You know what I mean? But I wish him the best because Derek James is good. If the chemistry good, no need of going back and forth. But you should have fucking called me. <laughs>
<laughs> but anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Roy Jones Jr. responding to Anthony Joshua working with Derek James and everything that happened between them two. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunch. Peace.